All right, old winch is off, new winch is on. The, uh, this is the base ring. I already finished this one over here. Uh, the base has uh, six of these bolts, like these, these Phillips heads. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. On the back, there's a backing plate. It's similar to this, but bigger. I made it a, an aluminum shop or a metal shop last year. This is my rig for holding the screwdriver. This one is keeping it, the screw from turning. Uh, the Phillips head or the screwdriver is in the Phillips head. This one is just holding it tight with this on it to give it some weight so it doesn't push up out of it. And it worked on all 12 of them. I was able to install them all myself by hand. Uh, it's basically globbed up uh, marine grade sealant. Um, I built this uh, jig right here. It's got uh, six holes drilled in it at the same pattern. And it's, of course, it's two two by 12s uh, screwed together and glued together and then drill pressed to put those holes in it. That keeps this long bit from changing angles. And so uh, it was a little bit off. The uh, holes on these are a little bit off. And so the, the jig was a little off. And then I moved the whole winch forward about Eh, almost an inch uh, The reason is is because that gave me better width this way So I got a better grab on the outside edges closer to here and here and uh, now I just uh, Put the guts back on it Which are here This is rebuilt a couple of months back it got a little dusty, but it's really not that bad and uh, then uh, just slide this top on and uh, there's all three of my winches they uh, actually finally mounted this is years after I bought them many years um, I've been trying to figure out how I was going to do this and that jig was the answer that's what got it so there you go